May 18, 1969, at the Kennedy Space Center in Florida, Apollo 10 stood ready on pad 39B. It was the work of 400,000 people and would carry three of them to the moon, two of them within nine miles of its surface, the closest man had ever been. that had to be made before others could safely land. By 10 a.m., Thomas Stafford, John Young, and Eugene Cernan were ready and received an affectionate send-off from an upstart beagle from a comic strip. Snoopy, a pilot himself and longtime mascot of the Apollo Quality Control Program, really deserved to go along. Anyway, he was there in spirit and in name, and throughout the complex and difficult mission, good humor prevailed a mood which the world shared, a good thing to have when you're out there alone.